the Stanley Juvenile Airdor is next. Uh, I'm Decent sized field of four yards for this one. And a top creative force for David Hooley. Holcomb Highness, Derek Hinton, Professor Plum, Martin Lidham, Quasi Cadeau, David Robertson, Scampetta, Paul Road, Sibford Ferris, Darren Thompson, Callis Quest, Martin Lidham, Dominion of Angels for Paul Rhodes, Hawcott Slane, David Robertson, likes it like that, Joshua Sutherland, Milau for Craig Beckwith, Rune Hunter for Leon Van Rensburg and Turquoise for Stu Gray, a grade one win in Stu Gray with all, so he won the grade one with last week, and away we go, can he double up on the grade ones, ten years to win his first one, and less than ten days to win his second one, if he can do it, and they get to the first of the 13, and they're all safely over the first one, and the second as well, and Scampetta, scampering off into the lead like he likes to do, with Holcomb Harness in second, and then Dominion of Angels back in third, Rune Hunter, is fourth with Professor Plum after that one. And then Turquoise on the inside. With coolest Quest tracking that one. And likes it like that. And then the two David Robertson horses, Hawkett Slain and Quasi Cadeau. With Creative Force and Mila the back two as they get to the third. Which they're all successfully over. And Derek Hinton's Holcomb Highness has now gone into the lead from the Rhodes pair second and third as they get over the fourth. Safely over that one. Holcomb Harness in front, Scampetta a length behind in second. Three quarters of a length down from that one is Dominion of Angels in third, then a gap of two to Silverwood Ferris. And a length behind that one is Professor Plum with Turquoise half a length down from that, and the nose banded likes it like that as they go past the camouflaged winning post. And that's not camouflage, just a little hidden. And Holcomb Harness has opened up by two then now. As they take the fifth. All safely over that one. Really good jump by Professor Plum. Saw it jump past Dominion of Angels, who was admittedly a little bit ponderous at it. But it's Holcomb Harness who continues to show the way to Scampetta second. Dominion of Angels has got back into third on the flat. Then Professor Plum's now back in fourth. Turquoise after that one as they take the sixth. Which again, they're all over okay with Milo. Just the back marker. Holcomb Harness continuing to show the way, but only by a length. His tail tickling the nose of Scampetta. With Dominion of Angels back in third. And then Professor Plum fourth. And Sibford Ferris and Rune Hunter as they take the seventh. All safely over the seventh. And Holcomb Harness will lead them into the eighth. Which again, they all stream over nicely. Order not changing up, the pace has been pretty hot throughout then as they make their way down towards the next. This is the ninth of the 13 and they're all safely over that one. I think that funny double should be coming up soon where one fence is a bit like a wall. This is it. And over it they go. And then down the other side. Catches a few out that sometimes, but it didn't today. And it's Holcomb Harness in the lead then with just a couple to jump in now. It's Holcomb Harness in the lead from Scampetta and Dominion of Angels. Holcott's Lane has now moved through on the outside. Then Rune Hunter, Quasi Cadeau, Professor Plum still on the rail. Then Sinford Ferris, Turquoise being pushed along. Coolest Quest is going to try and come round the outside and likes it like that. And Creative Force are going to come even wider. Milo is out of shot. But it's still Holcomb Harness with two to jump. Over the second last they go. Holcomb Harness lands in the lead from Rune Hunter and Holcott's Lane. Then Quasi Cadeau and Coolest Quest now starting to motor on the outside. No sign of Turquoise yet as they come down to the last. Over it they go. It is Rune Hunter from Coolest Quest. Here comes Sibford Ferris. Professor Plum's flying on the inside. Now Turquoise starts to unleash a run on the outside. But it's Professor Plum who's bursting into the lead. It's Professor Plum who comes up to take it from Rune Hunter. Professor Plum from Rune Hunter. Rune Hunter's fighting back. Professor Plum's hanging on and Professor Plum's going to take it from Rune Hunter. Second Coolest Quest is next in Turquoise. Stu Gray, anything you can do, I can do too. And I said there was a big win in one of my four year olds this season, as there usually is. And it's taken to the final race of the season to do it. We pick up another another grade one for a four year old, and definitely the best division for me in the jumps. I think Professor Plum for Martin Lidham takes it. Rune Hunter for Leon Van Rensburg second. Coolest Quest for Martin Lidham again third. Simford Ferris for Darren Thompson fourth. Quasi Cadeau was fifth for David Robson. Where was Turquoise? Oh, there he was, sixth. So, 
My four-year-old's not as good as yours then, Mr. Gray. 